How you doing today? Welcome to Mo's Math. Today we're going to discuss inches of water column. And before we get into that, we need to understand that one pound per square inch of pressure can push water 2.31 feet. And that is based on one foot of water equals 0.433 static head pressure. So let's take our calculator and put one in. That's going to represent one PSI. We're going to divide by 0.433, that represents a linear foot, static cut pressure. Press equals, we're going to get 2 point, let's round that up to 2.31, and that's going to represent feet. So if we take that feet and we convert that to inches, we get 28 linear inches. That's where we get 28 inches of water column equals 1 PSI. The inches of water column term is a pressure measurement value just like pounds per square inch. The inches of water column measurement is commonly used to measure natural gas pressures. For the low pressures of gas, a manometer would be used. A manometer is a device to measure pressures. A common simple manometer consists of a U-shaped tube of glass filled with some liquid, in this case water. With the U-tube manometer, connect one leg of the U-tube to the positive pressure source and leave the other open to the atmosphere. In this example problem, the left, left side of the tube is connected to the gas pressure. The right side is open to the atmospheric pressure. If it went two inches up on the right side and two inches down on the left side, it accumulates the total, total height of four inches. So your water column is equivalent to four inches of water column. So let's recap what we just covered. 1 PSI will push water 2.31 feet. 2.31 feet, 2.31 feet is equivalent to 28 inches of water column. So we could say 28 inches of water column equals 1 PSI. We could also say 14 inches of water column equals a half PSI. 7 inches of water column equals a quarter PSI. And a manometer is used to measure low pressures such as used in gas installations. So I hope this helped you understand this and there will be more to come talk to you soon.